Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today we are playing Backpack Battles because it just came out in early access on Steam. It's blowing up right now. I think it already has like 2,000 overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam. Uh, and we played it one time when it was in the demo. It was really, really, really fun. And now that it's in early access, we got to check it out. So obviously there's a ton of new content. In the demo, I think there was only the Ranger and the Reaper. Uh, we only tried out the Ranger, but I want to try out, there's two new classes with early access, Berserker and Pyromancer. And I want to try out the Pyromancer, because that's that's kind of really cool. Um, and uh, so we'll try to kind of remember how to play the game. It seems like the Pyromancer starts with uh, two flames, which start of battle give us heat. And heat means all items trigger faster. And then we have a random sword. So we'll go ahead and do an unranked game here. Um, and so how this game works is uh, we want to, we have five lives and uh, we want to, if we if we lose a fight, uh, we lose a life um, and uh, we want to, I think, get as many wins as we can. It's kind of like super auto pets and stuff like that. Uh, the UI was updated a lot. Yeah, makes sense. So I know I have some character stats here that you might not be able to see, but I think I can mouse over some of these things. No, I can't, but whatever. You'll, you know, we'll figure it out. Um, we'll see if there's a better place. So I guess I start with a leather bag. I start with 12 gold. Um, you gain, you will gain gold every round, next round plus nine. I don't know if there's an economy. I don't know. Um, either way, let's see. So deals damage for the food, start a battle, star weapons, gain one damage, um, star weapons. Um, there's also lump of coal, um, pan, opponent misses an attack. Let's just get this shield maybe on attacked melee, 35% chance to prevent four damage and remove stamina from the opponent. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just buy a shield. I think that's a decent amount of money. I don't want to lose our first thing. Um, so, uh, yeah, we'll just do that. We also have stamina usage. Um, so we generate one stamina per second. We're only using 0.7 stamina per second. So how this game works is we're going to start the backpack battle. And so we find this is an actual player's build. Someone named Baka. And they have this build. And so now we just kind of auto fight. So we're auto using our, our weapons um, as we have the stamina for it. Uh, we're slowly building, you know, we're getting this buff, the heat, which is allowing us to attack faster. The problem is, is I think he's healing with the berry. I probably should have bought more. Am I going to win? I won. I won. Very, very close. So obviously we're trying to get a certain amount of wins. I'm going to turn the volume up. I think it could be louder. Okay. Wait. Start of battle, gain a flame. Oh, do I keep? Wait, I got another one. That's interesting. I could also buy another flame. Huh. Okay. Also, there's like, I think, upgrading things and there's like recipes and stuff. So depending on, um, you know, you can combine things. That's like a whole recipe thing. I don't really remember. Uh, health drop. If, if my health drops below 50%, I consume this and heal for 11 and I cleanse poison. Um, potion after being consumed also applies the effect of a star potion without consuming it. So we're going to get a potion. We're going to buy that. Piggy bank, shop, enter, gain a gold, start a battle, gain two maximum health for each start a battle item. Starred, start of item. Um, stone can only be thrown once uh, per battle. On hit, it destroys shields. Sure, we'll just do that. And we'll uh, we'll do our next uh, run here. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. But it's just, I'm super excited. I could see this being a series. Oh, we're fighting this person. So here, let's pause to kind of like look, right? So deals additional damage per in power um, and triggers 30% faster during battle rage. Okay, I th this person doesn't seem like they've got very good build here. So we're getting all this fire. We're starting to trigger our uh, items faster and faster and faster, doing a lot of damage. And when we get hurt under below 50%, we're gonna be able to uh, health potion. I think we already used it. I don't know why they're attacking super fast. Fatigue damage, cool. So we won our second round here. I think volume is probably a little bit too loud now. I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, we keep getting more fire. It keeps spreading here. Okay, we're gonna buy a leather backpack, expand it, so we can keep getting more and more fire, I guess. Uh, oh, this this upgrades, I think, with it. Wait, it's acting like this upgrades here with spike shield. So I think when we end, I think how recipes work, spike shield, yeah, so we could get a spike shield if we combine these two. I think we have to play the run, though. Yeah, I think we have to do a round, and then they'll upgrade. Um, I start a battle, we just gain spikes. I don't know if this is the best build. I don't... Um, it's Why is it acting like we need Gloves of Haste as well? Why is it acting like... Um... Hmm. Oh yeah, you can click things. I saw that too. Um, 
It's acting... Oh, Claws of Attack. So do I want Claws of Attack or a Spike Shield? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, let's go Spike Shield. Wait, why is this being... Wait. Start of battle, star items trigger 20% faster. Is that a star item? I don't really know how star items work. Um, and I think instead of that, we're going to take another fire, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how to play this game. This is the first time I've played the Pyromancer. So, it's cool that you can keep things in storage. This person's doing a money build. Got a dagger trying to trigger extra attacks. Trying to get some vampirism. So, we've been poisoned. Uh, luckily, our health potion, once we use it, we'll get rid of all the poison. Okay. So, we're attacking more. Um... We're getting more and more of this fire, this heat build. I think we're going to lose, though. Yeah, so we lost our first round. We lost one of our lives. So sad for us. Okay, so this got upgraded to Spike Shield. On attack, um, you know, we have a chance to prevent damage, remove stamina from the opponent, and gain spikes. So we're going to constantly be gaining spikes. Apparently, the dagger upgrades with fire. Molten dagger. How do I get molten dagger? And see, until we make it one time, you don't know the recipe. So you have to kind of discover some of the recipes. <gasps> sure, we'll definitely do this. Why is it acting like... Oh, do I need two daggers to make like a molten dagger or something maybe? I could see that being the case. Let me re-roll. Oh. Uh, okay, Pestilence Flask. Pestilence Flask. Um, that would upgrade the dagger, but I kind of want to try to do the fire stuff, right? Start a battle, gain 45, resist 3 debuffs. That would be pretty good. I, I'm gonna just go for this. I'm just gonna go for this. Oh, there has to be two fire next to it. Oh, there we go, there we go. Okay, okay, cool. Okay, I see how. So, okay, so it's gonna upgrade next round. Sure, we'll just see. I did not mean to reroll. <gasps> Three backpack slots and an extra maximum mana. I love that. Any more amounts of bag stuff is really good. And then, uh, every 3.5 seconds gain, uh, mana, which is, we would need if we did, uh, you know, um, magic items. If you have at least 10 water or 10 mana, gain luck instead. I'm just gonna go piggy bank. Gain two maximum health for each start of battle. Oh, for each adjacent start of battle item. Oh, stars are just the adjacency thing. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, so this, okay, so this is going to allow start of battle. Oh, I get it now. I get it now. So then we actually want this here. Like, adjacency stuff does matter. Um, yeah, so now, oh, it's only left and right. Okay, okay, that's fine. This is perfect, though. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Throw, put the stone in there. Okay, here we go. Let's start our battle. A lot more confident here this time. Fighting another Pyromancer. Person's got kind of similar, similar build to us here. I think I got... A lot more going on. I'm adding spikes. I think you re maybe removed some of my spikes with something. But yeah, we haven't even used our potion yet. Yeah, we definitely won this fight. Definitely won this fight. And if the fight lasts too long, there's fatigue damage. We both just start taking damage. We've gotten three wins. We've only lost one HP. So this is now upgraded to a Molten Dagger. On hit, use one heat to gain two damage. And on stun, triggers an extra attack. Also, why is this acting like it would upgrade with something? Oh, lump of coal. Oh, you can sock it. On hit, 70% chance to deal an extra damage. Okay. Oh, and I'm going to get an upgrade called burning coals. And then um, walrus tusk could upgrade. Oh, with the claws of attack. Okay, okay. And we'll put the stone in here. More fire. Okay, we're starting to get a build here. We're starting to get a build. Okay, fighting a, um, this person here, they got claws of attack, which I think is what we're trying to get here. So, I don't know, that fire dagger, molten dagger should do pretty good. Oh, dude, it is, dude. We're doing insane amounts of damage. Wow, we won that so fast. Okay, so this, we got two different upgrades. We got burning coal. Oh, it got burning coal, so it got upgraded. Um... Now it has a 12% chance to deal 6 damage and gain a heat. Oh my gosh. Another stamina slot. Leather boots. Health drops below 70%. We gain uh, luck. Uh, we gain empower. And we gain block once. That's pretty good. Apparently stone skin potion and stone would upgrade something here. 
Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and get leather boots. Sure. Um, and what would an, a whetstone weapons gain more damage? What would, oh, this is going to upgrade the hero sword. Uh, we probably need even more next to it. Um, I'll reroll. No, I didn't have any money. Actually, yeah, click to reserve. I want all of the backpacks reserved. Also, a pineapple. Uh, this is a spikes thing. Gain spikes. Every four seconds, gain spikes and heal for three. Uh, we do have spikes because of spike shield, so I might reserve that as well, honestly. Yeah. Okay, we'll throw the stone in here. Okay, let's try to do our build. I think I think we can do this here. Uh, this is a pretty good build here. He's got a bunch of lump of coals, and he's got an axe and a forging hammer. Let's get some crystal build. See, I haven't played a ton, so I don't know everything, but... Dude, oh my gosh, this build's crazy. This build's crazy. We're just destroying people now. Okay. Uh, add one backpack slot. Start a battle gain seven. Yeah, we just want backpack slots, honestly. I love backpack slots. So that's definitely what we're going for. Um, yeah, backpack slots. Might do the... Yeah, I'll get the pineapple right now. Pineapple, pretty good. And then we can still get a fanny pack. Items inside are triggered faster. We'll go ahead and put the pineapple, so it's triggering that more often. And we'll reserve this backpack, any type of backpack I want. By the power of capitalism. Okay, so here we go. Start battle. Dude, I think we could I think we could win. I think we could do this here. This fire build's pretty good. Okay, another fire build. He's got Goobert. He's got a healing. So this person's got some healing on them. But we're buffing ourselves. We're just getting more and more damage here. You can have all the heal you want. That person ran out of stamina. Dude, we are bodying. We only need a couple more wins. Yo, Firebender, what is this? I don't know what this is. Firebender, Crusader. Choose one and only well, one. I, yeah, I guess you get some quirky things every time. Every three seconds, use mana to gain heat. Trigger 10% faster for each fire item next to it. And if we get to a certain amount, we get a bunch of luck, regeneration, or just deal a bunch of damage. So we are definitely going to get that. So we'll get Firebender. We're going to want to make sure heat is all around it. Um, yeah, we want heat literally just all around it. Oh, well, God. What have I done? I, I wish there was like a control Z. I really wish there was a control Z. Okay, because this... Oh, this isn't buffing up anything next. Okay, this isn't buffing anything up. This is just a separate melee weapon. So, we can... Why Why does this have to... Oh, this... Does this have... No. I don't know what's happening. Okay, we want just fire surrounding this. We want fire literally just surrounding... Why can't I put fire here? Why am I... Oh, because that bag doesn't exist. This is so weird. The, my bag system's been a little bit weird right now. That's okay. We just want to make sure to put as much fire around him uh, as possible. Um, become the Fire Lord. Okay, Spike Shield. Doesn't matter if it's next to anything here. Okay, we're going to put Pineapple right there. Okay. Um, hmm. I don't think this really matters where it is either. Fire pit. Oh, shop entered. Oh, so that's our passive. Spend one gold to generate a flame. Start a battle gain. Five maximum health for each fire. Oh, item inside. Oh, uh, okay. So we are for each fire item inside. Does this count as fire? Yeah, this is at the very bottom. So we want to make sure we get as many of these fire items as possible. Okay, okay, so we're pretty much entirely surrounding now. Um, problem is, is now we don't have a ton of room, but actually, yeah, we can. We can put the spike shield there. Okay, I think we figured it out here, because none of these really need good adjacency things here. There's another fire I could get. Um, protective thing here. Actually... We put that there. That way we can go ahead and put another fire. There's a maximum amount of fire, dude. This is going to trigger so fast because of this Fire Lord build. Oh my gosh. Okay, protective purse. Um, okay, hungry blade. So we're still very low. We're, we're not spending... Oh, wait, we, we need these things here, though. 
Um, let's see. Yeah, I want... Wait a minute. I want to make sure this is in the backpack where... Um, I love this storage thing. I very much enjoy this storage thing. What is ha what is happening here? There we go. Put that in there so it's in two different things. Oh wait, that's not the one that's attacking faster. What is the one that, that they attack fast? Oh, that's the fanny pack up there. Okay. Well, I actually want this fanny pack. Right, we want the fanny pack. This can go like that. There we go. So now this is attacking, the, this, the pineapple is attacking faster. Um, this is so weird actually. I'm being very weird with this. Um, okay, wait, fanny, there we go. Two fanny packs, so now it triggers super fast. There we go. There we go. Got our boots with the fur. Um, okay, gain two maximum health for each start of battle item. Hmm. So I actually want more of these start of battles to be next to me here. Oh, this is the one getting buffing some other weapons. Um, okay, we could put a weapon. Nah. Okay. Uh, nothing crazy. Oh, I definitely want claws of attack though. But that would mean one less thing on the friendly fire. Okay, whatever. Even if it's not optimal, this is better than nothing. I think we actually get rid of piggy bank. Probably get the wooden sword in because I have I have so much um I have so much extra money. Yo, wait, thorn whip does something. Okay, wait, we gotta buy thorn whip. Problem is, is this is a very I don't know I don't know where this fits into our uh, into our build here to be honest. <laughs> I just I oh, I just had a good idea. Where, okay, how does this fit? Fl okay, flame whip. Because I definitely want to learn how to make the flame whip. That's very important to me. Um, we just kind of have to figure out... I, I like the spikes. The, the spikes part of this build is important here. So I need to be able to replicate that. Um, okay, so I think what we do here... Is we do this. So this fits exactly like that. We can get the flame whip. However we want. We put this here. We get the shields there. Uh, problem is, is the boots is... I, I definitely want to get the boots. And this is seeming to be a little bit harder to get the boots. Um, hmm. 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 So I am using a little bit more stamina now with this. I think these leather boots are really important. I think... I think for the time being... We get rid of one fire. This is still gonna upgrade, I think. Yeah. So we're still gonna get a flame whip. Okay. Okay. I know that was that was a lot. That was a lot of changing around. I think we made our build super cool with this friendly fire now, though. Let's see. So we should be building a bunch of spikes. We should be getting a crap ton of fire. We don't we're not we don't have any mana generation. But we have a lot of spikes. Man, we are using our heat. So we're not able to actually just generate a bunch of heat. We won though. We won. We won. We won. Yeah, we could sell the fire, but I don't feel like I necessarily need to do that. Okay, so now we got the flame whip on hit. Use spikes to gain three heat. That's really good. I love that. Oh, it's a different thing. Okay, that doesn't count as... Why does this not count as a fire item? So, wait. Triggers 10% faster for each fire item. Oh, because it can only count as one of those. Okay, well, that's fine. We do that. So it's missing one. That's fine. Um, Draconic Orb. 15, if we get to 15 fire, your next five hits are crit. Every 2.5 seconds, remove a spike from your opponent and gain... Oh! So they can take... I can take away their spikes to get fire. <sighs> Oh, that's really good. I also want the potion belt. Oh, back. Okay. Oh, that's sick. That's sick. Um, okay, now we are going to sell some items so I can get this potion thing. Uh, first four potion slot. Uh, uh, first potion inside consume. I get a random buff. So that's pretty nice. Um, okay, what else do we want to put in? 
There is a freaking pet. Uh, okay, we don't have much money. We'll just put a fire in there. We'll put the piggy bank in. Put the whetstone in, even though... There we go. We can buff that up, sure. Okay, this is, this is really good. Yeah, our stamina is medium. We regenerate one stamina per second. We're using 1.3, so I think we're going to be okay overall. Dude, that draconic orb. If they have spikes, they are screwed. We might actually be able to get friendly fire to trigger now. Okay, they got regeneration. They got mana. Okay. So if we get to 20 heat, we'll do something. When we get to 15 heat, uh, next five are critical. Okay, okay. So our next five attacks are crits. Um, now we're about to get to 20, which will give us a bunch of luck. We did it, dude! Oh my god! Also, wait. Since when did we regenerate our health? I don't know when, why we regenerated our health. Huh. Okay, holy armor. We could get some fire. That's really cool, but I don't know about that because we've kind of got a bunch of other stuff. Probably going to use this vampiric potion when we drop below 80%. We steal some life and we get a little bit of vampirism. So I'll go ahead and get that. Get that instead of piggy bank. We'll add the fire here. We'll go ahead and re-roll just in case. Uh, fanny pack, probably what we want. Um, actually, I'm going to I'm gonna reserve that stamina sack. We'll go ahead and put that thing in. Go ahead and get piggy bank. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Get the mana orb. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like it's... Oh, no, it's connecting with that. No, I think we got, I think we got this. I think we got this. This, this fire build's good. This we, is too good. Okay, we're fighting another fire build. Uh, we have less accuracy, apparently. We're already about to get... Okay, oh, I think they have spikes. Oh, dude, we, we counter anyone that gets spikes here. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, man, dude. I think they just built a bunch of uh, vampirism. Dang. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. Uh, sure, we're going to get stamina sack. And probably it's like godly, but um, I'll buy another stamina sack. So we just start with a bunch of stamina. Reroll. Ooh. Reflect hatches after two rounds in your backpack. There's a fire egg, dude. I want a fire egg. Okay, we'll do this. We're gonna sell the piggy bank, and we're gonna buy the fire because it's on sale. So after two rounds, we're gonna get some sort of legendary fire dragon. That sounds pretty cool to me. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Sell the fire now. We put it in our bag. Put it in our bag. Start a battle like gaining more heat, right? If we can start with a bunch of heat. Oh, he has thorns. So we're able to take the thorns away. We're gonna build this heat really fast. So we already got to 20, so we already have more luck. If we get to 40, we'll get a bunch of uh, regenerate. Oh, we won. Never mind. We're already one away. So we may not even get to see what the ruby egg does, to be honest. Small chance we don't get to see. But you know what? That would be okay. Okay, spear. Um. Oh, I didn't mean to buy that. I didn't really mean to buy that. Um. Hmm. You know what? We don't need it. We don't need it. We'll just hold on to it for now. Start battle. You can go endless. Oh, okay. Okay. We might do that then. Okay. Though if we lose this, we'll have another chance it'll hatch. Okay, they're reflecting a bunch of stuff. They're poisoning us. Luckily, we'll be able to get rid of uh, at least four of the poison. Dude, it doesn't matter, dude. We just killed already, so we won the game, baby. <laughs> Choose wisely. Take the win or start survival mode. Survive 18 rounds, six left. Okay, we'll try out whatever the survival mode is because I want to see what this dragon egg is. Yo, godly ruby whelp. Start of battle, gain two heat, reflect two debuffs. Wow. And all items trigger 2% faster per stack of heat. That's crazy. And then apparently it can evolve with the draconic orb. Okay. 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 I'm okay with that. Uh, every five seconds, gain one heat and heal five. When you have at least 10 heat, cleanse one debuff. Sure. We'll get a chili. It does cost stamina, but we have plenty of max stamina. I, no, it doesn't. It doesn't. 
Oh, zero. Yes, zero stamina. I, I misread what you were saying. Reroll. <sighs> um, bunch of extra shield at the beginning is pretty nice here. Um, okay, we're gonna go bam. We're gonna go bam. Put the chili here. So this does cost a lot of stamina. But I'd like to evolve it to see the Molten Spear. So we're using a lot of stamina per second, which might be a bad thing, but we get a bunch of extra. So now let's see how the survival stuff, that wasn't here in normal. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. He's getting a bunch of spikes, which we can take. So, oh wow, dude. Yeah, we're removing, our stamina is a hard problem here, but that's fine. We're at 27. When we get to 40, we won, dude. I <laughs> we are destroying here. Okay, so we got Obsidian Dragon. Now if we get to 15 heat, uh, gain three damage and trigger an extra attack and all items trigger 2% faster per stack. And then Molten Spear. Before a miss, use one heat to hit instead and deal extra damage. That's cool. So if anyone's lowering our accuracy. And if we hit, destroy four block for each fire item in front of it. Oh. Okay. Okay, well, we'll put the boots. That is very interesting. We'll put fire there. We'll put fire there. We'll put fire there. And then put fire there. Put the boots right there. Okay, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, the dragon can always attack. Yeah, this is really good. Um, okay, uh, we'll go ahead and reroll. Blood amulets, start a battle, gain two vampirism and 20 maximum health. Okay, let's get another potion ball, belt. Um, stone skin potion, when you have at least 45 shield consumer, that's not gonna happen. Uh, we'll get a blood amulet, sure. Sure. Start a battle, gain uh, two vampirism and 20 maximum health, that's pretty good. Okay, let's see. Dude, this build is insane. Oh, yeah, I did miss the fire up there, yeah. Above him. We could optimize it more. Okay, so at 15. And a bunch of extra attack. These we're fighting another uh, fire here as well. Ooh, this person's this person's got a bunch of other stuff. Oh god, we got destroyed to this person. We got destroyed to them. Okay, so okay, fire, yeah, wants to go next to this guy. Technically missing one, but whatever. Um, okay, uh, more maximum mana is kinda nice. If you have at least 20 debuffs, consume this and cleanse 10. After being consumed, also applies the effect of the uh, potion next to it without consuming. Wait, why is this acting like it would be next to this? Um. Okay, nice. Even more... Divine Potion. They have to be pointing at each other? Hmm, okay. Let's try it here. We still have plenty of health. Okay, fighting this person here. They got a lot of potions. A lot of shield. They have spikes. That's good when they have spikes. Because we get to take their spikes and turn it into fire. So we're already at 15 heat. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh jeez. No, this person had so much vampirism. Oh gosh. Okay, now we're starting to get destroyed here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, okay, let's see here. I only have three potions. I want to get another potion. That's what I'm trying to do here. Oh, I see what you're saying. Well, but don't I want them pointing at each other? Oh, no. It wasn't pointing at each other. Oh, it's just adjacent. Oh, there we go. I do want one more potion, though. And practically large greatsword. Uh, we'll re-roll. Shield of Valor. That's a fire thing, apparently. Um, opponent regenerates health. Consume this and inflict three poison and one to myself. It's not that great. Um, okay, fanny pack. I have plenty more room for things. Um, hmm. Hmm. I could maybe get another Molten Dagger, but that's really not what I need. Um, potion, another potion thing. Divine Potion, okay. There we go, wait, so. 
Is it just always... It's like always what's above it. The potions are always just what's above it. Okay. Whatever. Let's try this here. I don't know. I don't know. We're trying to do the fire stuff, but... Okay, they got spikes. That's good. I don't know. I think our mana usage might not be the best. We have a lot of max mana. Whoa! A, I took a, a crap ton of damage immediately there. I don't know, guys. We have two HP left here. Um. Hmm. Every five seconds gain. Okay, another chili pepper. Another chili pepper would be very good. Um, it's triggering faster. Um, you can't stack chili pepper with chili pepper. Um, sure. Another backpack that gives us some more shield. Another chili pepper. Okay, okay. We're generating a lot more fire now. Okay, we're generating so much more fire now. Okay, hopefully we can get to the friendly fire thing. We're already at 15. We're already at 20, so now we got a bunch of luck. At 40, we're going to get regeneration, I think. Though that very rarely happens. We're at 31. Come on, we're at 32. No, dude! No! Ah! We have one more health here. Um... Hmm. 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 Um, let's see here. Vampiric potion. Okay, I think, yeah. Vampiric potion, maybe. In oh, increase base stamina. Now I see why everyone was telling me to get this. Base stamina regeneration for each buff you have. Gain 3% of the buff. Yeah. Triggers. Yeah, let's, let's go ahead and actually probably try to get that. I just don't know what I would get rid of, actually. Um, how much do these sell for? Four... Okay, okay. Okay, because, yeah, I think stamina... Stamina's kind of hurting us here. So I'm going to just get rid of these. We got this. So now our stamina is better. Okay. I know, I know I'm misplaying partly. I, I This is like the second time I've ever played this game. You cannot expect much from me. You gotta, you gotta understand. <laughs> okay. Oh, I probably should have tried to put those pets together. Whatever. We're in endless mode. I'm not, like, that concerned. We technically won. Oh, this is another fire person. And I think this fire person is going to body us. We're already at 35 fire. Come on, we're good to be to 40. Give me to 40. We got some regeneration. Come on. Come on. No. <laughs> oh, that's fine. We did get 11 trophies, though. Or no, that's how many we had, I guess, before. So I guess they counted the demo progress. Okay. Well, that's fine. We'll do one more. We'll do one more Pyromancer. And then, you know, maybe we try out the other classes if you guys want to see more in the future. But I, I want to I give Pyromancer one more try. One more try. Yeah, Fire Pit. That's what I missed, the passive there. So we'll do Ranked. I don't really know. I know there's items. Oh, these are all of the items in the game. It's all of the items in the base bags in the game. Wardrobe. That's, I think, what you can use trophies. Uh to unlock, I guess. Yeah. So there's two different skins. But I think you have to unlock these, I think. Um, okay. That's cool. Cool cool little thing. Okay, so... Do a pet build. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Okay, so we'll do... We'll try ranked. I don't really know the point of doing ranked or not doing ranked. Um, okay, whetstone. I think already maybe upgrades. We could get a hero sword, potentially. Um, we just want, oh, let me re-roll, a uh, lump of coal, bam, and then that way it'll already turn into a burning coal. Um, re-roll one more time here, already got some backpack stuff, we could get more flames, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just get more backpack slots, I'm sure we'll get one more flame. You can get a dragon class that works with the warp. Been tiger, so, dude. I don't even know what that is. I don't, like I, that's the thing. I know so little about this game, but I'm I'm happy to be exploring some of this stuff. 
It's just a very fun game. I could, like I said, see this being turned into a series. So if y'all want to see, or want to see this as a series, or mini series, you know, let me know. That bunny thing. Yeah, if we had put those two pets together, the, that last fight probably would have been a bit different. Okay. So we got the uh, burning coal. Um, if it is in a weapon, yeah, chill, triple percent chance to get more damage and gain uh, fire. Um, broom, whetstone. There we go. So now it'll turn into a heal hearing so uh, healing, whatever it's called. Okay, and then reroll. We'll go ahead and get an on sale another backpack slot. Start a battle, get a little bit of regeneration. Just get some small things here early on. Spend our money on. By the power of capitalism. So we're fighting Bloob. Another pyromancer that's got a fire hammer. Also, I need to put the fire in this starting bag. Just gain five maximum health for each fire item inside. That's what I want to be doing right now. They are out of stamina. That hammer apparently takes a lot of stamina, though it's stunning me. Or having a chance to stun me. Luckily, I have this uh, health regeneration. Let's go. Got our second win. We upgrade these into the hero sword. Oh, which we could then get close to getting a burning sword. Let's go. Start a battle. Weapons next to it do more damage. Chili pepper. We'll do fire. Get a chili pepper. This isn't a fire weapon, so I... Uh, no, nah, that's fine. I will get piggy bank here. Earn some more money. Oh, burning coal. I had accidentally taken that out, apparently. I don't know when we did that. Maybe when it upgraded. Okay. Okay. Archer here. Burning sword generates a lot of heat. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited. That seems pretty cool. This person's got vampirism and regeneration. We have a little bit of regeneration. Just a little bit from the healing herbs. We got this. Fatigue damage. Yeah, I think we're fine here. Probably... Yeah! Cool. So now we have... The Burning Sword! So what is it? On hit, 60% chance to gain heat. 5 heat gained this, and weapons next to it gain more damage. That's pretty cool. Honestly, maybe I just try to get a bunch of those. Right? So now we have the Wooden Sword. And we're gonna start trying to- If I could just have a bunch of Burning Swords... That'd be kind of cool. Um, unattacked. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get a shield just because I can. Kind of no reason not to. Fall that cheap. It doesn't take any mana either. Okay. Oh, wait. You can... Wait. Oh, I can... Oh, I can upgrade the Burning Blade even more? Huh. Huh. Okay, I'm I'm fine having multiple burning swords. I think I think I kind of like. Oh wait, is it? Oh, it might actually be upgrading that. I don't know. I think it's now actually gonna wait because of the order that I just placed those in. So once we get something to help with this heat, it'll be pretty cool. Oh, I am using a lot of my uh, energy though. It's fine though. We still got it. Okay, more fire. Lump of coal. We're going to get a torch, apparently. I don't know if that's really what we want, but sure. Um, Reroll. Sure, another fanny pack. And we'll get more health regeneration here. Why not? At the beginning. Kind of cool. Okay. Okay, we have four health regeneration. That's pretty cool. Building up this fire. Dude, having all this health regeneration is kind of nice. <laughs> yeah, gain more max ability for next start of battle. So I probably should have him close to these things. Whatever. Um, okay, burning torch. or well, We have a torch. On hit, 25% chance to gain a damage. We'll turn it into a burning torch. It's kind of spicy. Thorn whip, but we're not really doing the thorn uh, type of the fire build here. Uh, potion ball, sure. 
out of stamina. Consume this, regenerate two stamina, and gain in power. After being consumed, also applies the effect of the potion above it. Uh, or we could go chili pepper. Um, yeah. Chili pepper's kind of cool. Chili pepper's kind of cool. So we're going to go for that. Okay, here we go. It's not running out of stamina. Ooh, dragon scale. So he's getting a bunch of, I think, spikes and shield is what this person's trying to do. Build our fire up so easily, but... Yeah, don't have a ton of mana. Oh, I, no, I don't think I got the stamina thing. I think I lose this one. Yeah. I think he got rid of my regeneration, too. But hey, we got Burning Torch. Start a battle, gain two heat. On hit, 35% chance to gain one damage if you have at least 15... Ooh, heat. Okay, there we go. That's cool. That's cool. The guy had a, a strong weapon or something. Draconic Orb. Remove spikes from your opponent and gain heat per removed. Okay. Got a Draconic Orb. That's pretty good. I'm not going to have any money to reroll, so we won't do that. Oh, start a battle. It's probably better to, yeah, do, do that. Cool. Okay, so Piggy Bank's super effective here. Okay. The little skull on the sword, it steals buffs. Oh. This person's doing deck of cards, blue eyes, white dragon. What? Or white eyes, blue dragon. What? <laughs> that character has Yu-Gi-Oh card build? What? <laughs> oh, we killed the Yu-Gi-Oh card build, apparently, very easily. <gasps> okay, okay, we got the firebender. So we're going to take the firebender. There's also the dragon nest. Dragon attacks, heal for seven. Dragon eggs hatch after one round. Dragon eggs are also offered in the shop. Okay. Chili's not a fire item. Oh, I thought it was. True, though. Um, yeah, let's, uh, I don't know. Let's try this dragon thing. I like that idea. I like the idea of the dragon nest. So, adjacent dragons attack when they heal me, or when they attack, they heal me, and dragon eggs are offered in the shop. Really? Is the dragon egg in the room with us? Is it in the room with us? Because it doesn't seem like it. It doesn't seem like it. Oh my god. This is annoying. This is annoying. What am I doing, dude? What the fuck is happening? What? Definitely gonna take a lot of space to, to get that figured out here. Okay, I want some eggs. Reroll. Where's my egg? There we go. Um, I don't know. Hmm. <sighs> Probably go for any type of dragons, I imagine. Um, we'll sell a flame. Okay, so now. This is going to immediately hatch. Let's put different fire items in there to buff us. Regeneration. Okay. Okay. Dagger. Okay. Start. Yeah, we've locked things before. Okay. So I don't know how this is going to go. Seeming to be pretty decent. I mean, all the fire sword stuff we built up. Holy cow. Let's go. Already won there. Doing super good so far. Okay, oh, is this hacked? We have an emerald whelp. Uh, they don't cost stamina, which is really cool. On the start of battle, I'm going to increase my accuracy. And uh, I'm also, every time it hits, I'm uh, poisoning the enemies. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, I would very much enjoy some more dragon eggs. Oh, okay. That's a pet. Increased base stamina. The thing is, I don't know if I have room for this. Though, yeah, I probably could. I just need to, uh, yeah. 
That's fine. We'll be okay. Oh, uh, you know what? We're gonna sell the health regeneration stuff. I don't really think I need these too much anymore. Uh, we'll sell... I'll keep the whetstone. We'll sell a single flame. We're gonna buy this so we can have more stamina usage. And it triggers this guy even faster. Um, okay, so now we're going to Draconic Orb. Um, piggy bank, whatever. I know I'm not getting optimal placements with that. I don't care. So we're not gonna have this buckler anymore. That's okay. Okay. Okay, they got a bunch of food. They're doing a food build. Thing is, is when this keeps attacking, I'm gonna just keep poisoning the enemy. So, oh my god, they died immediately. Died immediately. There's another egg. Start a battle, inflict four random debuffs. Hatches. Okay, so we're gonna take the chili. We're gonna replace that. Amethy oh, oh yeah, they take two. Okay, that's fine. We'll go bam. Another dragon egg. And then we're gonna get uh, we're gonna sell the shield so I can buy another leather bag there. We're doing the dragon build. Dragon build gonna go vroom. I am gonna lock that uh, lump of coal though. Okay. Dude, dragon build, dragon pet build. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh my gosh, dude, we are going crazy with this build. Oh, okay, wait. Oh, they got a lot of uh, health regeneration, but we're poisoning them. We're poisoning them pretty hard. Let's go, dude. We, we might win this undefeated. Okay, now we have an amethyst whelp. Start a battle, inflict four random debuffs on hit. Remove a random buff from your opponent. Whoo, boy. Okay, lump of, lump of coal. We're gonna get more burning coal, I guess. I can put it on the dragons. I don't know what that does. Oh, just resist a debuff. Yeah, no, we'll do that. Uh, Reroll. Um, sure. We'll get a little bit of a protective purse, and we'll reroll. Um, draconic orb. What is it acting like? It would buff with. Oh, wait. Why are you acting like you'll buff some? What? What? What are you claiming? What? What did? I don't know what these things are acting like. Oh, burning! Wait, burning coal. Oh, I think that just means it'll turn it burning coal regardless. I think that's all that means. But you know what? Two draconic orbs. If they have thorns, they're f they are screwed. They are absolutely screwed if that's the case. Okay, this person's doing fire. They have a phoenix. They have a phoenix here, but we're doing just general dragons, dude. We killed. Oh, oh, that was a big heal. They got really low. That's fine, dude. We we are bodying people. I think we 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 got every single one a win. Start survival mode. Survive 18 rounds. Ranking change plus 19 to plus 51. So I think you have to like choose whether you can go more long term. We'll do it because that's like the fun thing to do. Got another burning torch. Um, burning sword, burning torch. Um, probably more, more uh, pet stuff. We're looking for more drag, uh, more uh, eggs. That is definitely what I want. We could get another, uh, yeah, we're gonna reserve that. I don't know if I need all that stamina actually though. But it's, that uh, it could be good. That could be good. That could be good. Um, okay, I think what we're gonna do here is we're gonna move that right there. We're gonna do this here. Yep, there we go. So all of our dragons are healing us, which is just really good. And yeah, we'll put those. No, no, I want the two weapons next to each other. Yeah, I guess I can't really make that the best optimal way ever, but okay. And you know what, I actually don't need this. We're not really using stamina much. Ooh. Okay, um. We definitely just want anything to do with more. More storage is gonna go a long way. We'll get the potion belt. It's a pet. Um, everything next to it, to the right of it, triggers fire and faster and we remove luck from them. Okay, okay, okay. We'll lock that pet thing. Oh, oh wait, oh, reserve, I reserved it. I like that you can reserve things. Oh, okay, wait, that canceled it actually. Cool, okay, yeah, I want to, yeah, I want to get the burning blade. 
We're gonna upgrade the burning sword, I think, into the burning blade, I think. Okay, because if we're going endless, we learned last time we need a lot of help for that. Okay, this guy's got a uh, ruby welt. Dude, we just are bodying them in so many different ways. All of these dragons. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's another dragon orb. There it is, dude. Burning blade. On hit, gain heat. Four heat gained. When I gain four heat, this and next adjacent weapons gain more damage. Cool. Um, it's pretty sick. So now we're gonna go ahead and buy the uh, this thing. Wait. Oh, does it? What is it? It's kind of hard to tell. Um, there is another dragon egg though. That's probably gonna be the priority. But um, actually, that's most definitely the priority. Um, because this is a ruby egg. Let's see. Ruby egg. Boop. And then. Oh, okay, we'll just do that. That way, they're still it's still buffing this weapon. And then, yeah, we'll keep those two things reserved. Put a chili, fire, we have the burning coal. Actually, I'll put both burning coals in this. Because this is like our main weapon. Okay, this, <laughs> this build seems pretty good so far. Unsung cesspool. Oh my gosh, dude, we just body enemies here. Because we're removing their debuffs. We're about to have a third dragon. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Okay, so now we have a ruby whelp. Um, which... Hmm. I technically want this. I don't know. Either way. So now, start of battle. Gain two heat. Reflect two debuffs. It's pretty good. Um, okay, we're going to potion... Oh, man. Kind of running out of uh, space here. Um, okay, I think what we do here is I'm going to get that and then uh, it was a little bit weird. Okay, okay. Um, kind of need more space. I want to get this bird. Just trying to kind of think of the... I need space for it. So I'm going to keep that reserved. I'll re-roll. Okay, cool. Fanny pack. Perfect. So now we can put this dragon there. Oh, dude. Yeah. Obsidian dragon. Definitely want an obsidian dragon. And then we're going to get this bird. Put it right here. So now we're getting tons of extra luck, which I guess is probably going to be helpful. Allegedly. Probably. I don't know. Okay. Let's do this here. Let's do this. Okay, already starting with 23 fire. Oh my god, there's so many dragons! Okay, that was, they got a big heal. That's fine, though. Oh my gosh, because we, we effectively just ruined their builds. Most of this time. We got an obsidian dragon here. If I get 15 heat, gain 3 damage and trigger an extra attack. Though this is a bigger one. But it, it fits, it fits. We got it right there. Um... Um, okay, we can move this fanny pack right there, put this there, probably just more room for random things. I can't imagine we're going to be getting very many more pet things. Another bird, I don't think we need that much luck. Lump of coal, I'll go ahead and keep trying to get more burning coal, because we have a lot of weapon slots. Um, and... Might be able to get more of this, but it's starting to become a little bit awkward, so let's just get a health potion. Just in case. Just in case we got the money for it. Okay. Dude. We have one, two, three dragons. And then a, a rabbit thing and a bird thing. And I don't know if we're if it's a little bit easier because we're doing ranked and we're actually playing against people that have no rank. Right? Unranked, you know, someone that's a good player could still play. I don't really know. that They were doing some sort of luck build. We murdered them. But I don't know if we've lost a single time with this build. There's another burning coal. We'll go ahead and put it in that. Um, fire. Uh, what? What are you gonna combine with? What are you saying you combine with? Oh, the the thorns. Yeah. Reroll another potion belt. Um, hmm. Reroll. Um. Oh, another dragon egg? Do we do another? Probably. 
It's probably better than the bird. Okay, because we could put the bird right here. Um, every item triggers faster. We could make our our sword. Actually, yeah, we're going to do this. Yeah, that way this is making, this bird's making both of our, I like the dragons, but having both of our weapons attack faster is really cool. We're going to get another dragon egg. Oh, this is beautiful. Um, sure, another bag right there. Perfect. We got some more maximum mana. Get some start of battle maximum health. Um, it's chili pepper. Actually, yeah, that's fine. Put that there. Put that there. This build is insane, dude. Oh my gosh, this is a crazy build. Yeah, this is insane. Yeah, they, oh, they, they have even more pets than I... They have more dragons than I do. Let's see. Let's see. They have more dragons than I do. This might be my first loss. Might be my first loss. Yeah, I think it is. Our first loss was to another dragon uh, build. They had way more dragons than us. First loss. Okay, that's fine with me. Um, more slots. Mana orb. Gain some vampirism. Opponent below 30% health. I do more damage. If it was in armor or other, seven debuffs inflicted. I gain shield. Yeah, let's just... I don't know. Corrupted crystal. Get some other things. We got another dragon. We can get another obsidian whelp here if we do this correctly. City and dragons seem pretty good. Not gonna lie. Another dragon! Another dragon! <laughs> well, uh, do I- I probably do, right? I probably want to do that. So, we're just gonna have to kind of move everything that's important. Oh, like, this needs to go... I don't know. I might... I'm gonna have less maximum health. But I think this is definitely worth it. I think this is definitely worth it. We're gonna go ahead and sell our piggy bank. Sell a fire. Another dragon. We're gonna get as many... As many eggs, as many of these as we can possibly get. Um... Mm, okay. And then, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Dang, this is kind of awkward. Because I want to move that there. So, yeah, then this could buff up as well. So, it's affecting multiple things. We want that to become an obsidian dragon. Problem here is now, this weapon's not going to be in the optimal slot. But after that obsidian dragon, maybe it will. <sighs> Man, or maybe we... Actually, I think we just put our weapons right here. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Weapons here. There we go. That way, bird still affects it. No, it doesn't. Almost does. What if we put the bird... Right there. There we go. There we go. Okay, so still affecting the swords. We can put a bunch of the fire in this fire item here. There we go. Chili. All this fire. Okay. Okay, cool. Cool. I think that was a good that was a good readjustment here. We have a little bit less max HP. Oh, they're doing a Yu-Gi-Oh build! I don't even know what the Yu-Gi-Oh build is. We bodied the Yu-Gi-Oh build though, so. Let's go. Okay, I think we only need to win one more time. Got another dragon. Gold obsidian good old obsidian dragon here. Let's go. Uh, we have a, a socket. Bam. Um, Reroll. I think we're going to win probably regardless. This is kind of a very good build. Protective uh, purse thing. Uh, sure, gain some more shield on that. All of those are really good because we don't need to have more inventory room for them. Okay. I think we should get this. We got this. Don't even worry about it. We got this. 
We have so many dragons, though. This guy's got a lot of spike stuff, but I think I'm removing a lot of his buffs. I think we did it! I think we did it! Let's go! Did we win? I think we won. We won for real. These baby survival bonus. We had four tries left. So we we made some progress here in bronze. Let's go. Let's go, baby. That was cool. That was cool. Man, this game's a fun game. This game's a really, really fun game. I'm super happy that we were able to try out, um, you know, the, the new class, right? This is our second time we've ever even played the game in general. So uh, there's definitely a lot more content, practically an infinite amount of content, I would say, uh, just with all of the different builds and stuff that, that you know, you can get. So uh, if you guys want to see more backpack paddle videos, definitely let me know. Oh, there's different rankings for each class as well. It's in the bottom left, but uh, that's very interesting here. So yeah, let me know if you want to see more backpack pack battles i would love to make more videos on it so let me know uh either way you know make sure you guys subscribe uh, also i should probably say i forgot to mention uh dev gave me a free copy of this game need to stay transparent totally forgot uh but that that is yeah that happened um but yeah if uh, if you guys want to see more let me know make sure you guys subscribe uh ring that bell like all the big boy youtubers say to be notified uh, if more backpack battles videos come out if there are some they'll be on the screen right next to me check out the playlist as well uh, in case we have multiple builds we had obviously when we tried out the demo we had some cool builds then so, uh, yeah. Uh, and if you guys are going to be grinding out some of this awesome game, Backpack Battles, on your own, then I wish you guys luck and see you all next time.